What's up, Stu crew? We're just out in the garage. A few guys just doing manly things. Zade's helping us. Hello? Warden's out here helping. Hello? Um, we are kind of like halfway changing things, remodeling. I don't, yeah, you wouldn't call that. Reorganizing, that's a better way. This shelf that's in the corner, Warden's helping me rip that out. And then actually, if you can see behind me, Carlin started driving, so I chose to sell the Explorer and get a Jeep for myself. So, uh, we're like gonna hang Zay. some racks. Oh, Zay, get out of there. What are you doing? So we're gonna hang some racks. Well, we already started, but we've got to reorganize on this side to hang the doors and whatnot. So just kind of organizing the garage, getting ready for summer, and uh, it's gonna be fun. Just the guys out here having a work day. Carlin's running some errands to get some stuff for Zade for his birthday this week, so we'll keep you posted on that. Also, I don't know if you saw this when I was filming earlier. Yesterday when we were trying to mount some Jeep doors and whatnot, Warden was finding a stud, and then this part, he said, was just really weak, and it just, like, caved in on him when he was tapping it. And I was not tapping hard. No, not at all. He said it might just be, like, some old water damage or something, because we did have some plumbing issues at first that got resolved, so. He said he'll help us patch it up. <laughs> I am going to patch it up. I will fix what I broke. Warden is my guy. I mean, I, I know you guys are probably like, hey, Evan, do you know how to use a tape measure? I do. But pretty much all I've ever done is electrical. So like when it comes to patching and stuff, I'm not great. So I learn from this guy. Every time he does it, I watch and I learn a little bit more. Maybe after three years of watching him do it, I'll be able to do a little bit of it. You know what I'm saying? Warden's such a nice guy. So why stress out and take five hours to do it when he can do it in like 20 minutes? True statement. And I'm his assistant. You know how many things I've handed him? I'm pretty good at that. That is something that I'm good at. Dude. Level. I used to be an apprentice. I'm pretty good at handing people stuff. <laughs> See, a good apprentice knows what you need before you need it. Here we go, boy. Okay, shoot. Five second dance party. Okay. <laughs> What's up, Stu Crew? That's actually a loud car, not for like a sports car. Did you hear that? Anyways, we are at the mall. Zade's birthday is tomorrow. Our kiddo is turning two, I cannot believe it. I am trying to start a new tradition because my sister-in-law, Whitney, like every night before the kids, like after they go to bed, she decorates the house and then they wake up to like cake and decorations and like their gifts and it's like super sweet. So I went out running errands all day to get his gifts and like party supplies and it's just gonna be like small, just us. But anyways, I thought it would be like so sweet for him to see how excited he gets, but I thought that it was so sweet for me, like way more like, I don't know, people tell you that time flies like your whole life, but I feel like kids make it like fly so much faster. And I was like all emotional, like it was so special for me to like try and make his day tomorrow special. I don't even know if that makes sense, but I'm super pumped about it. We got him a cake, we got him balloons. I tried to go with like a golf name, but honestly, golf for kids is hard to find. He has a golf clubs from Christmas, so we're gonna see tonight if we can find him like a golf bag, but I don't know if they'll sell them um, where we're at. But we're gonna, we're gonna attempt. If not, I already got him other gifts. He's into Spidey right now, so I got him like a costume. So it's gonna look like gets to dress up as princesses all the time. Now he'll have something to dress up as. So tonight, we're going to take him to make his first Build-A-Bear. If you've never been to Build-A-Bear on their birthday, you can like, depending on their age, that's how much the bear will cost. So like if they're two, it'll be like $2 for a birthday bear. We did this for Layla for her second birthday. She actually brought her bear with her. <gasps> it's so cute. I love your bear. <laughs> it says, happy birthday, Layla Ray. Mommy and daddy love you. <laughs> I've heard that so many times. I've heard it so many times over the last two years. But this is like a fun little tradition that it hopefully is. like if we have more kids down the road, we'll keep up, but at their second birthday. Mommy, yeah. Build a bear. Daddy, daddy, well, maybe what? I guess Happy birthday one time, Kale. Oh my goodness, yay! Babe, you ready to get a bear? Yeah. I hear them again. Oh, let me hear. I hear it. Uh, no, that did not work. I did it two times. They did it two times. Oh, that is cute. I think it's actually glitching, so I'm gonna ask them if like, they can fix that or we could re-record it. I don't know. Anyway, so let's get inside. It's been rainy and like, eh, today. Running errands, so. 
will be our last thing of today though, so let's do this. Oh yeah? yeah? Okay friends, something Carlin, Carlin's always like very organized and creative when it comes to stuff like this. And something like she was saying, I think some of your family does this, Whitney and Zach or something. Yeah. She I'm was like, a new tradition. yeah, she was like, I want to try and start a new tradition where like we decorate like the night before and make their birthday kind of more of a big deal, especially in a kid's eyes. So like they wake up to like maybe some snacks, maybe some gifts like immediately with decorations. Like that's kind of cool. You don't have to just wait for a party at night or something. So Carlin just went and got decorations today. So we're gonna do that tonight now that the kids are in bed. Yeah, cake and all kinds of stuff. So I'm excited to see like him react. Obviously Layla will be reacting too. She thinks every party is her party too. So we're trying to make this more about Zayd and let this be kind of a lesson to her that sometimes other people celebrate things and you need to enjoy them celebrating Something my parents did growing up was like we they would take us out individually just us and mm. just like feel really special we got to eat and whatever. Yeah. Um so I think that's what we're going to do tomorrow. Tonight was kind of like a family thing. Yeah. And in the morning we'll do cake together and then we're just going to take him out on a special date and y'all yeah. just wait. It's going to be so cute. <laughs> yeah. It's something simple but I think he's going to love it. I get going big for my birthday for my mom. <laughs> yeah. They take birthdays more serious than like family Christmas and stuff like that. Like they've always been big on birthdays, which I guess they had a lot of them, so maybe that's why. <laughs> Carlin was hoping that these would be longer. Well, they acted like they were so big in the picture. <laughs> I'm not kidding. All right, guys, it's time. Zayd's upstairs. It's his birthday morning. Ready? We're ready for a birthday surprise. Woo! Come on. <gasps> what do you think? <laughs> oh, balloons. Would you like to get in the birthday chair? <gasps> yeah. Did this all for you, Zay. That's right. Take him off. Okay, you can have them. <gasps> Whoa! Yay! How did I know Spidey. that was coming? Happy birthday, buddy. Who's ready for gifts? Okay, we may have had a leakage this morning, hence the new birthday outfit, but we're ready to roll. A Spider-Man car. Alright, you want to open another one? All Zayd wants is cake. That's hilarious. 
But at first he wouldn't want let us cut it. Look what mom and daddy found you. What is that? Go! Go! Oh. Good job! Mom and daddy are gonna take you golfing today. Oh. Ball! There's a ball in ball. there. Do you want to go golfing? Yeah. Yeah. Let's go. A ball. I'm yeah. telling you, he the loves it. Shorter. He got more excited about this yeah. than anything today. All the other guests, he was like, whatever. Y'all, something bad happened to me last night. I was running around the side of the house and I stepped on a screw and now this morning I can like barely walk up the like my foot is so sore. I'm like, I don't think it around. was us though. We were working so. in the garage, but we didn't recognize any of the screws. It was that, a like, green screw. Yeah. Thankfully it was a screw and not a nail because it would have went all the way through my foot. Oh but man. This, my shoe stopped the screw, so it only like halfway went up. That's my right, foot. <laughs> I'm sorry. So, babe. yay. Carlin probably won't be golfing. <laughs> probably not. Go. Carlin's got to take the donuts with us, injecting them as she stores them in the box. Layla wants half of it. <laughs> Good job. I'm not going to lie, I got emotional a couple times watching you golf with Zade. Really? Like, I'm going to tear up. It was, I just am. It, it literally one of the most fun things ever. Like seeing him get so excited. Making it special and just doing something with just him yeah. was like so sweet. And the fact that he loved it. He was literally jumping up and down. He had one, he smacked off the tee. I'll have to find the video. I mean, smacked it hard. So cute. We're so proud of you, Z. Yeah, buddy. Happy birthday, buddy. What's up, Stu crew? Living our best life. Sitting in a Jeep, doors Sitting off. In a Jeep, the beautiful <laughs> weather. We need to take her out for a little spin. It's officially been a week since Travis and Katie have moved to Tennessee. So I guess you haven't filmed much. No, I've kind of let them just do their own thing on, on their yeah, vlog for now this week. Yeah, he's kind of done their own thing on their channel. But um, we've hung out with them pretty much every day. Literally. We've been rotating each other's house and then Warden's been coming over like every night this week. Every day been doing... this week, what are you talking about? <laughs> yes. We've been doing projects, maybe a little PS5 yeah. at night. Yeah, that you know, is, gotta I'm work slaying. and a little I'm play. Better. Anyway, so they've been hanging out with us. Zade had his birthday, that was really fun. Um, the kids came down with like a 24-hour bug, which was super annoying. I don't want to say it on here, but they were vomiting. It was gross. But thankfully, they I should be like up. coming over. Yeah. It was like did. just kids, I think. It was weird. Well, he got sick earlier in the week. Do you remember when I was dying? Yeah. True. In your living room. That was before our kids. He had a fever I, like, and everything. Fell that was asleep before. on the couch. Yeah, that's true. And you thankfully, Evan and I haven't got anything. <laughs> I woke up on the couch and nobody was home. <laughs> well, we went to church. Was yeah, that they all left. Oh, yeah, he did not feel like going. They just Poor disappeared. Guy. Yeah, we did that. I'm trying to think what else we've done this week. Anyways, we should show them the garage oh, for that sure. y'all been working on. This is like almost finished, but not finished. Yeah, still needing cleaning up and patching holes yeah. and stuff. We've pretty much like gotten rid of like a bunch of stuff yeah. and gave it to my siblings. But now we just like need to organize. But yeah. all the Jeep doors, doors, 
Roof, we might try to figure out something more sturdy, but like ratchet straps are pretty sturdy. So I think that's going to be fun. It seems very in there. Unless everyone gets on YouTube and it's like, oh my goodness. Good. Yes. Terrible. Tell me if you've ever had a ratchet strap like unratchet. And if that has ever happened to you, maybe I'll rethink well, something else. Well, they're eventually, they're, they're going to get bored. We were going to try to, we just didn't have it all. Short. But yeah. for right now, they've got the roof off and mm -hmm. it looks good here. Warden moved our um, jacket, jacket bracket yep. over there. Yep. It added a and added a rack. Once we clean up, we'll be able to pull the cars in. But Sade's napping. Uh, Layla and I are going to spend some time out here. Oh, and then the, the light pictures. Yep. We've got, like, got we've light had pictures just out the temporary here. light picture yes. for how long? <laughs> We're terrible at we picking stuff out. That's part of the problem. So the boys got this. And Evan just told me that they do color changing, which is kind of... Yeah, lively. there's an app for the lights and you can change the color. Kind of cool. Of course, Evan would go that route. <laughs> Anyways, you want to tell them what you're doing? You're pretty pumped. Yeah, so not going to lie. We're pretty stoked about the Jeep. We decided we're going to sell the Explorer. So we get this as my second car because now that Carlin's driving, she's driving the kids. If she, if we have to separate, she's normally driving the kids in the Tesla. Yeah. So the Jeep, like I had friends of mine trying to talk me into it. They were like, just sell that. Get a Jeep. You can take the doors off and do that in the summer so and you got a good deal on it, it we it's got a good deal cool. on it travis used to have a jeep so he helped me pick it out so we got the doors off got the roof off and it's super warm today so i think me warden and travis are gonna go hit a little par three um and we're gonna take the jeep so party time <laughs> evan has been waiting for it to get like pretty weather warm enough to do for this. forever because last year you know that he loved golf he was out there as much as he could but yeah Today's like the perfect day, so. Let's I'm hit it up. You. Doors off, roof off, we're busting. Got these little side mirrors I ordered. I'm little straps, I hear you have to have these. I'm putting it on. Carlin's adding to the mirrors. Wait, where did these little baby mirrors go inside? Is it mirror? left, right, up, down? I don't know. I think hey, yo. Let's go, golden top. Yeah, hop on in. Don't, don't, don't yeah, I got your door for you. Guys, you don't even understand how much of a game changer this is. So it's actually Good Friday and all courses around here were booked up because a lot of people are off of work. So we just came to this short little, it's a par three, it's like a junior park where people can just come work on their chipping, their putting, stuff like that. You walk this one, that's how it goes. We show up, they have electric bikes that you get to mount your bag on. Like this is a game changer. Like, oh my word, especially as bad as we are, we're gonna be chasing our ball everywhere. We're now we're gonna be riding it everywhere. Let's get it. This is going to be awesome. You put your feet up here. Yeah, yeah. dog. <laughs> Absolutely juicy. In the road. Dude, it was straight though, but did it go to all the way to the road? It's a good world. That would have been sick, bro. That was so close. Little chip in. We had a couple good shots to end it. All right, we're going to head out. We had our fun. Played terrible. We're going to head home. Kiss the wife. Hug the kids. Watch Tennessee lose in the NCAA, probably. No, we're going to win. Let's go. Let's go, Tennessee.